Disclaimer, this product was provided to the author to do a review. All opinions are 100% authors and authors alone. To have your product reviewed, visit bit.ly slash review my product. Hello everybody, Jackie from dreadandblotter.com here to review the, I believe it's Fimi Stand Mixer. So we're going to open this up and then we're going to make some cookies. So let's give this a go. <laughs> so here are some of the parts. This is the splash guard which goes around the base here so it doesn't splash all up at you. The stainless steel whisk, which I'll bring much closer. Here it is. And all of the little parts, like the accessories can go in the dishwasher. Um, the rest of it cannot, but stainless steel, and this is for, I wrote down, liquid sauce, egg whites, that kind of stuff. And then the flat beater, which is for salads, cake, mashed potatoes and then the dough hook and then here is the big giant bowl which I believe is five liters I read five liters so not too bad and to put it in you do want to make sure it goes in securely and then you want to lock it into place so it doesn't move around while you mix. And also on the bottom of this are little suction cups so it stays in place while you use it. So first it wants us, according to the machine, according to the instructions we need to do a machine test first. So. And use this little machine, this little hook right here, to bring it up and down. See if you bring it up and then lock it. It's gonna just stay in place, and then just hold it, lock it, and then it stays in place, so it doesn't move around while you. Cook. As you can see, the different power levels depending on what you're using: five to six for the whisk, three to four for dough, and one to three for bread. So. Very cool. This machine says it is built to be low noise. I mean, that was pretty loud considering, but I'm not sure how loud some of the other ones are, so keep that in mind. That could be on the quieter end. So, let's get cooking. Since I'm not making bread dough, I'm making cookie dough. I'm 90% sure that we're going to use the, what's this called, the flat beater, because cake was listed as a option in that. So, so this piece goes on top of these, not the other way. So then it can prevent all of the back splash basically from getting onto the machine and up into those that's you don't want it anything up in there so cool all right so let me put my ingredients in i also just cleaned out the bowl real quick because i'm not quite sure what is on this so just to be extra clean So, let's see what happens as we start to mix it together a little bit. As you can see, it's mixing pretty well. Putting it all together. Also, with this little latch, you want to make sure it's like, it actually stays because it will just hold like that but it's not all the way you want to make sure it's like all the way up and that latch goes back down and then it's secure so that is pretty much it there is my cookie dough and i am gonna go make a whole bunch of cookies so that's pretty much it that is the femi 
operating stand mixer and it mixes it's just great whole bunch of different parts these are machine washable i think i said that earlier just in case this one this one and that one are all dishwasher safe the rest of it is not so you will need to hand wash it but not really a big deal so that is it it also came with this cute little that i've been using to scrape down the sides of the bowl and then obviously eat the dough so <laughs> that is it thank you so much for watching and as always please subscribe to the dragon blutter youtube channel thank you